Hello, and thank you for joining Monday Mornings with Connie Russell. I'm Connie Russell, the CEO of CL Russell Group, a workforce training and development consulting company. The Career Focus Life platform is where we connect individuals with career focused strategies and resources to help them grow into the career of their choice. Today's Career Focus Life topic is how to respond to the interview question, what are your weaknesses? I selected this question today because I received this question quite a bit from unemployed as well as employed individuals. So let's get started. A job interview is all about presenting your best self, which is why answering what's your greatest weakness may be a challenge to some. The first thing to keep in mind is why the question is being asked. Well, it's definitely not to trip you up. Instead, it's to see if you're self-aware enough to recognize a flaw and then self-motivated enough to fix it. The reality is we all have weaknesses and that is something we all must own. The interviewer is not expecting you to respond by saying you have no weaknesses. So how do you respond without sabotaging yourself? One way is to avoid mentioning any weaknesses that you do not have a plan for addressing. For example, if you admit to being a procrastinator, be sure to share with the interviewer the steps you are taking to help resolve this weakness. When asking the weakness question, interviewers are looking for three qualities. One, self-awareness, two, honesty, and three, self-improvement. Number one, self-awareness. The interviewer's ideal candidate will not deny that they have real weaknesses. However, the weaknesses you decide to choose should not interfere with the duties of the job in question. Number two, honesty. Always be truthful about your weakness. An ideal candidate will not lie about their weaknesses. So choose a real weakness and talk about the steps you are taking to address it. Number three, self-improvement. An important element of your what are your weaknesses answer is showing self-improvement. Be sure to include details about the steps you are taking to learn a skill or new practices to correct your weaknesses. This will demonstrate you have a plan of action. Prior to your interview, you will want to make a list of your job weaknesses in advance. This will help you prepare, especially if you are asked about other weaknesses. And lastly, the best response to the what are your weaknesses question should include two parts, the weakness itself and what are you doing to correct it. Thank you for joining Monday Mornings with Connie Russell. I hope this Career Focus Live will help you get closer to reaching your career goals. If you found this information to be helpful, please like and share. Chances are it will be helpful to others as well. Enjoy the rest of your Monday. It's going to be an amazing week.